four teams, five engines in each. And today we will find out which of the teams is the fastest. So, the first team starting the challenge consists of Hero, Henry, Philip, Duncan, and Charlie. The contenders are supposed to overcome an extremely difficult track and demonstrate the miracles of speed and agility. Each contender should be ultimately careful and attentive. If one makes a mistake, the whole team is gonna lose. Wow! What an incredible track has been created by our innovative engineers! What spectacular mechanisms! What outstanding obstacles! Wow! That's just fantastic! And at the very end of the track, there's an ice mountain! This is just unbelievable! The first team has finished the relay race for just 1 minute and 20 seconds. Excellent! Good job! And now another team consisting of Dart, Victor, Gator, Edward and Toby will try its luck and will do its best to finish this track as fast as possible. Woo! I didn't expect he would ride so easily through this section! To get to the middle of the track took them only 37 seconds! That's 3 seconds faster than the previous team! Great result! Way to go! Wow! Check this out! That's incredible! You just look at that! This is just awesome! One minute and 16 seconds! That's an excellent result! Four seconds faster than the previous team! Now the list of the third team. Hurricane, Dash, Bash, Gordon, and Timothy. Let's see if they can show a better result than their opponents. Yoohoo! What an incredible speed! The first half of the track took 37 seconds. That's just the result of the race's favorite. Good job! Oh no! Bash got stuck at a turn and Hurricane is rushing forward to help his teammate. That's what I call a team game. Well, Bash's holdback can crucially influence the result of the whole team and cost them a victory in the relay race. Wow! That's unbelievable! I have never seen anything like that! 1 minute and 26 seconds! Bashes and Dash's team is on the last place so far! And we are continuing! Percy, James, Salty, Merlin and Thomas make the last team of today's contest! Oh, James! What a pity! The tender is back on the track and the race continues! This mistake might cost the team the victory!
the first half of the track took 41 seconds. Because of James's hold up, his team has lost a whole lot of time. Push on it, Merlin! Go, go, come on! Merlin has beautifully managed his section of the track, and now Thomas at full speed is rushing to the finish. Go, Thomas, go! Go, Thomas, go! Go, 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 Thomas! You can do it! Yes, yes, yes! 1 minute and 15 seconds! Unbelievable! This is the best result in today's race! Congratulations go to the winning team! 8 contenders and just one cop! Who's going to get it? Thomas versus Mike! Who's gonna become the fastest engine today? Wow! What a speed! I see Thomas is a real challenger for the victory! And... Thomas is qualifying to the semi-final! Let's see how fast the other engines are today! Timothy! And... Diesel! Go, go, go! You just look at that! Diesel is leaving Timothy far behind! Especially taking into account that Timothy is by far not the slowest engine! Diesel is finishing and becomes the second semi-finalist! Etienne and Hero! Who's going to win? Etienne is the winner of the great race, but Hero is known as the master of the railway in his home country, Japan. Oh, look! The contenders are not giving away anything! The forces are equal! And... It's a draw! No! A draw does not satisfy us! We need to determine the winner qualifying to the semi-final! That's why we've decided to organize one more round! It seems like Etienne is a bit tired! Or it's just Hero has gained some speed! What a spectacular race! And... Hero is finishing first and qualifies into the semi-final, where he's going to meet Diesel! Edward versus Diesel 10! Let's get going! It looks like the contenders are pretty tight! Who's going to finish first? Edward is shooting ahead! Finish! Ah! In the last moment, Diesel 10 is grasping the victory from Edward! The first semi-final! Hero versus Diesel! Blistering start! Wow! Look at that! Even Hero is not able to catch up with Diesel! What an unbelievable speed! Finish! Diesel is qualifying to the final! Thomas versus Diesel 10! <laughs> Thomas has left his opponent far behind! Th 
Thomas is faster because he's a speed master. Finish! Thomas is in the final. And right at this moment, we're gonna have the final. Thomas versus Diesel. Two incredibly fast engines. Who's gonna get the cup? Wow! Thomas is taking the lead with only half of his body. But Diesel is not trailing behind. Step on the gas, Thomas! Go, go! Thomas is finishing the first and becomes the winner and the owner of the great weekend cup. Congratulations, Thomas! Good job! You're simply the best! Hi, guys! You all have seen this outstanding treasure chase set. Thomas is doing his best to catch up with Skip and get to the treasure. But it seems to be too difficult for him to do it alone. They need to work as a single team. And Thomas is going to get some help from Gator. Right now, we are going to find out if these friends can handle it and catch the treasure chest. Yes! They did it! Awesome! Can other engines repeat the same success? Percy and Edward. Good luck to you guys. Ah, what a pity. They almost did it. Our next contenders are Diesel and Salty. Let's see if they can hit the jackpot. Yes! What a great team game! Wonderful result! Congratulations! The next team is James and Samson. Let's see how agile these guys are. Let's see what's going to happen now. Wow! The chest has stayed on the platform by some miraculous way. Unbelievable! That's a great job! Alrighty, we've got the next team in here. We're ready. And... Timothy! Let's go! Good luck to you guys! Ouch! The chest has almost made it to the platform! Ah, what a pity! And now... Henry! And Hurricane, show us your style. Whoa! Yeah, right. That's what I call top class. And now everyone who's cut the chest is qualifying to the next round and switch places. And now, Salty will try to catch the treasure chest 
And Diesel will be scaring off Skiff. Good luck, guys. Yeah, they've managed to repeat it. Excellent. Alrighty, now it's Samson's turn to catch the chest. And James is gonna help him out with it. And... Oh no! Samson should have gone a bit slower. They were so close to the success. And the one catching the chest will be Hurricane. Come on, Henry! Scare Henry off! Ah, what a pity! They almost did it! So, there's only one team left. Do you think they can do it? Now, Thomas is catching the chest and Gator is scaring Skiff. Yes! Yes! These are the true masters! They did it! Congratulations! Treasure Chase is a splendid set, especially for a team game. My friends, we welcome you at the Great Weekend Cup. Our first contenders, Percy and Hero. The start is given and the contenders dashed forward. Check out the unusual track created by the contest organizers. It's not enough to be just fast, you also have to be very agile and careful. Not bad at all, I didn't expect him to fulfill this task so easily. And Hero is winning and moving to the semi-final. Congratulations! Edward and Victor! The winner of this race will compete against Hero in the semi-final. Let's wish them good luck! Victor is instantly taking the lead and coming forward. We will need to ask Victor what kind of modification he's got installed in his engine. Perhaps it's an electrical engine! <laughs> and Victor is confidently winning in this race! Emily versus Freddy! Wow, what a speed! Look, Emily is taking the lead! Can she win in today's competitions? What do you think? Whom are you rooting for? Please write your answer in the comments! Emily is perfectly passing through difficult track sections and leaves Freddy no chance to win! Yeah! Emily! Wins! She is qualifying to the semi final. James and Thomas! From the very beginning, Thomas is gaining such a high speed that James is not even able to compete against him. Thomas is faster because he's a speed master. Only a miracle can help James to win! 
Thomas is going for a U-turn and there's only one obstacle ahead of him. He is easily handling it and finishing the first. It seems like James is not in hurry anymore. Thomas is qualifying to the semi-final where he is going to meet Emily. Victor and Hero, our first semi-finalist. Will Victor be able to outrun Hero with the same ease? Soon we'll find out about it. Wow, check this out. That's incredible. Well, it looks like Hero has no chances against Victor. Oh, have you noticed Hero's tend to come unhooked? Now he's not gonna have enough power to catch up with Victor. And Victor is becoming the first finalist. Who's gonna be his opponent? We'll find out in a minute. Thomas versus Emily. One of them is going to become the second finalist and meet in final with Victor that's surprising us today with his incredible speed. The contenders are quite tight in the forces today. Who's going to become the winner? You just look at that! This is just awesome! And… Just for an instance, Emily is leaving Thomas behind and enters the final. What a great race! Victor and Emily! And this is a final! The winner will become the owner of the Great Waking Cup! Wow! That's just fantastic! That's unbelievable! Check this out! Victor has rushed ahead with an incredible speed! I have never seen anything like this! And… yes! This is the Victor's victory! We congratulate Victor, our today's winner and the owner of the Great Wicking Cup! This was a very entertaining show! Thomas and James have decided to take all these cars up to the ramp! You just take a look how many cars there are! So, the engine going first is James! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Ten cars will be taken up by James to the very top! Let's go! Good luck, James! James has decided to gather some good speed first, but he has to be very careful here. Anything can happen because of too much hurry. At the very top, a dangerous turn is awaiting for James. Wow! You just check out how much the cars are jumping and leaning to the sides. Whew! It was really close. Well, it was a very difficult task, but James successfully fulfilled it. 10 cars is a splendid result! Good job, James! Now, let's see what Thomas will bring us. Hopefully, he will surprise us. One, two, oh, green car! Three, four, and this one is 
orange. Five, six, ha, that's a blue car. Seven, eight, wow, a black one. Nine, ten, wow, what a nice yellow car. And one more car. Eleven. Whooping eleven cars will be carried by Thomas. It means one extra car more than James had. Okay, let's go. Good luck to you, Thomas. Let's see now if Thomas is going to fulfill this extremely complex task. To take all these cars up to the ramp is not easy for such a little engine as Thomas. Thomas is approaching a dangerous turn and he needs to be really careful here. Wow! The cars are jumping and leaning to the sides and are just about to derail. Whew! It was very close this time. Everything went just fine. The danger is behind. Thomas has successfully finished the task. Eleven cars, one car more than James has brought. Excellent job, Thomas! Will James admit defeat? I don't think so. Well, well, let's see what we have here. Again, ten cars. And one, two, three, four, five. All together it will be fifteen. Whooping fifteen cars. James wants to carry 15 cars up to the ramp? Is it possible at all? Something really incredible is going to happen right now. Look how difficult it is for James to start moving. It's really taking him so much strength. 15 cars is a big number. And here's a dangerous turn at the very top. And James has stopped right there. What a pity! Oh, look! It seems like Diesel decided to help James. Don't be in too much hurry, Diesel. You have to be really careful now. Ah, what a troublemaker this Diesel is. You have overplayed here. Oh, James! Don't worry, my friends. James is doing just fine. We will help him out right now. Well, James wanted to win in this contest. But it looks like he overestimated his powers. But it's not a huge deal. He will have a lot of opportunities to demonstrate his best qualities. Four teams. Each one has all the engines of the same color. So, which of the teams will be the fastest one? Alrighty. The first team starting the challenge is the team of Greens. Gator, Henry, Percy, Emily, and Samson. Now it's Henry's turn to ride at full speed. Wow, that's just fantastic! Percy is the next one. Woo! I didn't expect he would ride so easily through this section. Now, Emily. 
The first half of the track is done in 40 seconds. Wow, check this out! That's just incredible! Samson is the last engine in the green team. You just take a look at that! This is just awesome! The team of greens has shown a splendid result. 1 minute and 15 seconds. And now, give it up for the team of Reds! Victor, Flynn, Salty, James and Hurricane! Let's see if they can show a better result! What a steep ramp! Hopefully Flynn is not afraid of height! Yes, he did it! Salty is carrying on the race. Let's see how good he will cope with this section of the track. Forty-three seconds. You guys better hurry up. Oh, James! His car has fallen off the rails. Woo! What a luck! The car has jumped back on the rails and James is continuing the race. Good job, James! Well done! Hurricane is up for the last section of the track. Icy Hill is a very difficult area for any engine. 1 minute and 21 seconds Unfortunately, the Reds haven't managed to outrun the Greens. Next one is the team of Black and Whites. Nurley, Hero, Diesel, Mavis and Freddy. After Merlin, it's Hero's turn to take up the race. Oh, Hero has got some problems with his tender. And it's really slowing him down. However, Hero did his best! Great job! Now Diesel is continuing the race! What a trickster this Diesel is! 39 seconds! Excellent! This is a good chance of winning! What an incredible speed! Mavis has beautifully managed to ride along her section and now it's Freddy's turn to show his skills. Icy Hill is not an easy trick. And with the result of 1 minute and 12 seconds, the black and white team is taking the first place. Now, the blue team consisting of Gordon, Edward, Timothy, Sir Handel and Thomas! Oh, oh, Gordon almost hit Edward off the rails! Hey, be careful! Oh, Edward's tender has derailed! Let's help him! This holdup can cause this team a victory in this contest. Push on it, Timothy! You have to catch up with them! The blue team has gotten over half the track in 40 seconds, and at the moment it's only one second behind the black and white team. Let's go, Sir Handel! Come on! Push on it! Excellent! What a great race! Go, Thomas! Make a push! Come on! 1 minute and 11 seconds! This is just incredible! 
This is a flawless victory! Congratulations! Hello everyone! And welcome to the Spiral Challenge! Our first contender is… James! His task is to push as many cars as possible up to the very top and send them down from the ramp and eventually get to the finish. In addition, each car has a different value. You can check that in the upper part of the screen. The engine getting more points is gonna win. And meanwhile, James is finishing the round and gets one point for the blue car and one more point for reaching the finish. Congratulations! Our next contender is Timothy. The red car is the most valuable one over here. If Timothy takes it to the finish, he's going to get whooping 5 points. He's losing the red car. The yellow one is also lost. It looks like Timothy is having some troubles. Ah, he got stuck him on the supports and cannot continue the challenge. So, Timothy's result is only zero points. Gator. Now it's his turn to try his best in this unusual and, as we find out on Timothy's example, not quite a simple challenge. Ah, the red car is lost. The orange car got derailed. And the yellow one flew down. Oh, Gator! How careless of you! Gator has sent two cars to the finish, but he couldn't make it himself to the finish line. But don't worry, he's going to be all right. Gator's result is three points. Excellent! And now, give it up to… The blue engine number one… Thomas! Be careful, Thomas! It's not a speed contest. The red car is already lost. Then the orange one goes off. But Thomas has managed to keep the yellow, green and blue cars. He successfully finishing and gets unbelievable 7 points. What a splendid result! Okay, the next contender is Emily. Let's wish you good luck! Note how carefully Emily is managing the cars. Ah! The red car is lost anyway. The orange one is still on the rails and its value is 4 points. Uh oh, what a pity. The orange car and following it Emily are flying off the rails. Don't worry, my friends. Emily is gonna be just fine. But unfortunately, her result is just 0 points. Our last contender is… Salty! Let's see if he can show a better result than Thomas. Ah, he didn't manage to keep the red car on the rails. The green car is falling off rails too. Following the green car, an orange one is derailing. Anyway, Salty has managed to keep the yellow car with a value of 3 points. Salty is confidently finishing with the result of 5 points. Congratulations! 
Based upon the results of today's competition, Thomas and Salty have become the leaders. Very soon, we're going to see them in the super final. Wow! Look how many Thomases we've got today! But these engines are different not only by the color, there's something else in there. Let's find out who is the fastest one of them all. So, the first contenders at the track are Muddy Thomas and Branch and Leaves Thomas. Check the track that we have prepared for our contenders. There's a lot of obstacles and difficult segments along the track. And meanwhile, the contenders are approaching the finish line. And the winner of this race is Branch and Leaves Thomas. Steam and Spark Thomas and Streamlined Thomas. Streamline Thomas is pretty fast thanks to his streamline shape. Do you think it will help him on our track? Actually, there's not a lot of straight segments along the track where he can develop his highest speed. Hmm, that means the speed is not always the major factor. So. Steven Spark Thomas has won in this race. And now, Cold Dusty Thomas and Icy Thomas. Well, it seems like Icy Thomas got a bit frozen while riding in snowy mountains, and his firebox cooled down a little too much. This makes Icy Thomas way slower than his opponent, Cold Dusty Thomas. So, the winner of this race is Cold Dusty Thomas. Congratulations! This Thomas is qualifying to the semi final. So, the next contenders are All in Seaweed Thomas and Real Steam Thomas. In this race, we will find out who's gonna be the next competitor of the semi-final. Wow, look at that! The engines are confidently going through the challenging segments on the track. So, with the minimal advantage, the all in seaweed Thomas wins in this race. Congratulations to him! And now we have approached the semi final. Cold Dusty Thomas versus All in Seaweed Thomas. Only one of them is going to make it to the final to be eventually called the fastest and the most dexterous Thomas in today's challenge. At the very last section, all in seaweed Thomas has managed to shoot ahead and won the right to compete in the final. Congratulations! And right now, we're gonna find out the name of the second finalist, Steam and Spark Thomas versus Branch and Leaves Thomas. It's not gonna be easy for Branch and Leaves Thomas to win in this race, because Steam and Spark Thomas has even outrun Streamline Thomas. And we've got the second finalist, and this is Branch and Leaves Thomas. Excellent! And right now, we are to witness the great final of this incredible challenge. So, the finalists are All in Seaweed Thomas and Branch and Leaves Thomas. Woo! 
I didn't expect he would ride so easily through this section. And here's the finish line. What? Is it a draw? No, it does not satisfy us. Let's have another round because we need to see the real winner of this race. Hopefully, this time we'll be able to determine the fastest finalists of today's contest. Wow, check this out! That's incredible! Yes! For just a split of a second, Branch and Leaves Thomas has left his opponent behind and won today's magnificent challenge. Congratulations, Thomas! Today we have a very unusual guest. You might have seen him in Journey Beyond Sodder. And his name is a cost himself. Hurricane! Like a storm! Whoa! Hurricane versus James! And now let's find out for how much Hurricane is a fast and powerful engine! We will organize a challenge between Hurricane and other engines! Jeez! Hurricane has decided to cut the way a little, but this is unfair! My friends, let's help James catch up! <laughs> now engines are on equal terms! But in this round there were many unsportsmanlike tricks, so we think it's a draw! Hurricane's next opponent is the blue engine number 2, Edward! Come on, Edward! Try harder! You can do that! Hurricane was a bit lingering before the very finish and allowed Edward to win! Edward wins! And now green engine number 3, Henry! Against Hurricane! Well, it's not going to be an easy ride for Henry. The track is quite snaky and will not allow him to gain full speed. The contenders are almost tight and they are showing not a bad speed! Go get it, Henry! You can do that! Speed it up! Oh, Hurricane is shooting ahead and wins in this round! Hurricane wins! And this time, Hurricane is going to compete against Thomas! Thomas has come out on the track in his streamlined shape! Let's wish the contenders good luck! Hurricane, speed up! Juice up! chance to our guest, Thomas wins in this contest! Thomas wins! So, my friends, Hurricane is a splendid engine and he is in a great shape! 
he's full of molten metal cars are producing sparks all around the place. Hurricane is going to take his place of honor in our collection. Hello, my friends! Today we will find out if other engines will be able to win the fastest of Thomas's, the branch and leaves Thomas. So, Thomas's first opponent will be Diesel. Let's see if Diesel engine can outrun our hero. Wow! What a speed! And... Thomas is coming to finish first. The next opponent is... Hyugo. This unique engine with the propeller is quite fast and probably is able to outrun Thomas. Wow, check this out! That's incredible! Oh, this naked track will not allow Hugo to gain some speed. Oh, look! Hugo did not manage to go through all obstacles and he derails. Thomas! wins and we are going to the next opponent and this opponent is going to be charlie well charlie is not the fastest engine but what if he manages to do what others couldn't intriguing right Thomas is faster because he is a speed master. And Thomas is finishing first again. Congratulations to him. And Thomas's next opponent is Henry. This is a tender engine and perhaps he will be powerful enough to outrun Thomas. Thomas is totally uncatchable today. And once again, Thomas is showing a splendid result and finishes first. This is unbelievable! And this time, James is going to race against Thomas. These two engines do not always get along with each other. You know that, right? So, right now they have a good chance to figure out who is the really fastest engine here. Right, and James also couldn't make it first against Thomas. Thomas becomes a winner again. Hurricane is gonna be the next contender now. Maybe he will break Thomas's lucky streak? You just look at that! This is just awesome! Hurricane has almost caught up with Thomas! But no, and this time again... Thomas got the confident victory! And Thomas's next rival will be Merlin! Is it possible that this silver engine will outrun our champion? Hmm, let's see what's gonna happen now! Sometimes miracles do happen! 
Wow, that's just fantastic! And Thomas is getting his deserved victory again. Streamlined Thomas vs. Shooting Star Gordon. Today we're gonna find out who's among them is faster, more agile, and more powerful. And in the first contest, we will learn how good these engines can drift. Wow, look at that! They're doing it in such a spectacular way! I see these engines are in the perfect shape today! So, who's gonna win? Whom are you rooting for? Please, write your answer in the comments! And… Gordon is coming to the finish first and becomes the winner of the first round! The score is 1 to 0 to Gordon's favor. The one getting more points than the opponent will become the winner of the contest. Meanwhile, the speed track with obstacles is ahead. Will Thomas be able to outrun Gordon and even the score? Go, 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 Thomas! Keep the pace! Yes! Yes! What an incredible speed! Thomas won in this round and the score becomes tied! 1 to 1! So, it's time to check how much power the engines have! They both need to push up a very heavy car on the very top and then rush down to the finish! Percy, be careful! Don't get out of the shelter! Woo! That was cool! Thomas did it and got one point! Now, it's Gordon's task to repeat Thomas's success! Well, well! Look how he's doing that! Woo! What a heavy car! Oh, Gordon has lost his tender, but this didn't prevent him from finishing and making the score tight. Two, two, that's a draw so far. Alrighty, and the last contest is to happen right now. Head to head challenge. The one getting first two points is going to win this round and become the winner in today's competition! Ah! Gordon didn't manage to stay on the edge of the destroyed bridge! And Thomas has turned out to be more agile! 3-2 in the favor of Thomas! Let's continue! If Thomas repeats his success, he will become an undisputed winner! Maybe Gordon will take revenge and even the score? Unbelievable! I just can't believe my eyes! This is a victory! Gordon was very good today, but not as good as Thomas! With the score 4-2, Streamline Thomas wins today's contest! We congratulate the winner and all his fans! Four teams, only one will become a winner! Gordon and Ryan against Henry and Salty! Go, go, go! Let's wish good luck to the engines! The 
the engines are finishing the first section of the track, and now Gordon and Henry are continuing the relay. Gordon is a little bit ahead of his opponent. Will Henry be able to outrun him? The last turn before the finish. And... Gordon and Ryan's team is winning this race. The next contenders are James and Gator against Thomas and Percy. Let's go! The first section of the track is finished almost simultaneously. What an intriguing race! Who's going to win? The engines are approaching the finish. And... Thomas is finishing first and brings his team the victory. And we are going to have the final race right now. Thomas and Percy against Gordon and Ryan. Let's cheer our favorite engines. Whom are you rooting for? Please write your answer in the comments. The engines have finished the first section of the track, and we see that Thomas and Percy's team is rushing ahead. Pushy Thomas! Come on, come on! Outrun Gordon, Thomas is getting the victory for his team. We congratulate Thomas and Percy. Today they are just the best. Nurlin versus Hurricane. We know these engines from the journey beyond Sodor. So we're about to find out who's the fastest more agile and more powerful engine. All right, in the very first contest, the engines are going to demonstrate how good they are at drifting. Woo, check this out. They're doing it really professionally. I can say the engines are in a splendid shape at the moment. It's really interesting who's going to win today. And it turns out Hurricane is finishing first now and becoming the first round winner. The score is 1 to 0 to Hurricane's favor. The engine should know that the first one receiving more points will get the victory in this contest. Oh, as far as I can see, there's a speed track with obstacles ahead. Let's find out how fast our ranges are. Well, compared to Berlin, Hurricane can really be called a high speed engine. The score is 2 0. Now, it's high time to find out how much power the engines have. In this round, both of the engines are supposed to push a really heavy car up to the top and then go down to the finish. Oh no! Merlin got stuck! What a pity! It looks like he didn't manage to finish this task. 
As we can see, this is by far not an easy task and even quite dangerous. Will Hurricane be able to cope with it? Duncan, look out! Hurricane is easily finishing this challenge and getting one more point. 3-0 in Hurricane's favor. So, now we are having the final contest, Head to Head Challenge. The contenders are supposed to meet at the destroyed bridge and the engine's task is to stay on the rails. Collision! And... Nolan is falling off the rails. Hurricane is far more powerful and agile than Nerlin. The score becomes 4-0. Round number 2. Will Nerlin be able to put up a fight against Hurricane this time? Let's wish him good luck! No, no, Merlin is not capable of standing against Hurricane. Let's thank Merlin for taking part in this contest. He was really doing his best. With the lopsided score 5-0, Hurricane is winning today's contest. Congratulations! Four teams, two members in each, but only one team will become the winner of today's competition. Bash and Dash against Scarlowy and Sir Handel. Let's get going! And we're wishing good luck to the engines. One of Scarlowy's wheels got off the rails, but he's courageously continuing the race. The first section of the track is dealt with, and now it's Dash and Sir Handel's turn to get moving along the track. Dash is doing his best, but Sir Handel is not trailing too. Here's the last turn right before the finish. And... Scarlowy and Sir Handel's team becomes the winner of this round. So, the next engines in line are Mavis and Dart against Duncan and Freddy. Let's get started! Mavis and Dart's team is dashing ahead. Duncan and Freddy's team has to make a lot of effort to catch up with their opponents. Wow, what an interesting race we are having here. I wonder who's going to win? The contenders are getting closer to the finish. And... Mavis is coming to the finish first and gets the victory to her team. And now it's high time for the final race. Scarlowy and Sir Handel against Mavis and Dart. Let's all together support the engines! Guys, whom are you rooting for? Please write your answer in the comments. The first section of the track is finished, and we can see Mavis and Dart's team is shooting ahead. Hey, come on, Sir Handel! You can do that! And... Having left Sir Handel behind, Mavis is grasping the victory for her winning team. Let's all congratulate Mavis and Dart. They did a great job today. Alright, 
Thomas vs. Fiery Flea. We are welcoming you with the opening of a new season of the Great Weekend Race. The race is taking place on a new playground. If you like it, please put your likes and share your impressions about the track in the comments. Thank you! Wow! Thomas is the lady! Yeah! Woohoo! Be careful! A ramp with cars is ahead! So, who's gonna be stronger? Yes! Thomas has turned out to be stronger and faster! Thomas wins! Congratulations! Edward and Philip! Go, 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 guys! Do your best! My friends, please write in the comments what engines you would like to see in our competitions! Come on, Edward! You can do that! Philip, come on, buddy! Catch up! We believe in you! Yeah! Edward is finishing first and he becomes a winner! James and Zonti! I want James to win this race so much! And whom are you rooting for? Please write me your answer in the comments! Oh no! Phew! My eyes play tricks on me! Yes, yes, yes! James is winning in this competition! Diesel and Percy! By the way, Percy has never won against Diesel in our competitions! Do you think this time he will manage to do it? Let's support Percy all together! Sean and Percy, come on, the finish is close already! And for the first time in our competitions, Percy has won over Diesel! Excellent job, Percy! Spencer and shooting star Gordo! This is gonna be a really hot race! Two streamlined engines! Who's gonna be faster? Wow! What a speed! Woo! Spencer has left Garden behind! What an incredible race and unbelievable speed! Congratulations, Spencer! Gator! And Toby! Two not the fastest but very useful and loved by us engines! Right, speed is not the strong point! Going up without cars? But anyway, <laughs> he's got a dinosaur! Toby is winning this race! Congratulations, Toby! Emily and Fearless Freddy! Hopefully our charming Emily will win in this race!
Yes! She's going through the speed section first. What is left is to only handle the rampant cars. Outstanding! Excellent! Emily wins! Hugo and Henry! Henry has to make an effort here. This engine with a propeller is not by far an easy rival. We see Henry is in a splendid shape and there's nothing to worry about. Flawless victory! Henry wins! Wow! It was a spectacular show! Please subscribe to our channel not to miss our new videos! Put your likes, share this video with your friends, and we will see you later!